Roman's life is really like a series of miracles and catastrophes. People versus Polanski is one of the longest running sagas in the criminal justice system. It was high profile before people even called a case high profile. There had been interest after your film appeared. That was what got everybody interested in the case again. Roman Polanski is under arrest in Switzerland and facing extradition to the United States for having had sex in 1977 with a 13-year-old girl. I call my mom and go, like, turn off all the TVs. I don't know what's going to happen. I knew then that this is an explosion in my life that is, like, not going to stop. Polanski entered Switzerland at the wrong time. I think it's a little strange, all the people walking around with, like, signs, free Polanski. Oh, he's a child molester. Chacun, chaque citoyen, français ou américain, aujourd'hui, est devenu un petit tribunal à lui tout seul. In a surprise move, Roman Polanski may be transferred to house arrest. We found ourselves in the middle of a firestorm, and we were not ready. Why is it that you won't talk about this? What is motivating the prosecutor? Well, maybe this is revenge. We are still here a year later litigating the issue of Mr. Polanski's surrender. That is not the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. It's not. You know it, I know it, Mr. Waldron knows it. How can it be so obvious that it's not justice, and it's not working now, and it didn't work then? Like, isn't anybody else going to stand up and go, this is wrong?